if I told you If I told you just half of everything I've always wanted to Welcome back, Camille. Right now I am getting ready for the day. I'm going thrifting with my sister and we're going to the bins. If you don't know what the bins are, it's like a Goodwill. I think it's a Goodwill. I think it's like still technically a Goodwill. But instead of everything being organized and on racks and hung up, it's just a bunch of piles of clothes in a bunch of bins. But it's really cheap because they go by how much it weighs and not by how many articles of clothes you got. So at the end, they just like weigh it out and give you a price, almost like frozen yogurt. <laughs> and since everything's so buried and it's like such a hunt to find good things, there's some real gems hidden there. And that's one of my favorite parts about thrifting is really digging for some good finds and then like when you finally find something, it's like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I found this here. I've been wanting to go to the bins forever. It's pretty far away, but I'm finally making time to go and I'm going with London, my sister. It's gonna be so much fun. So I'm getting all cute for that. I think I'm gonna do like a blue look. So I'm wearing black and white. We're matching. It's gonna be really cute. I'll show you guys our outfits later. But I figured some like blue makeup would be a really cool accent. So I just got this blue mascara and blue eyeliner. Let's have some fun. That was really hard. I have had far too much caffeine today to keep a heady stand. A heady stand. A teddy. A steady hand. Now I can't even talk. All right, going in. Actually, we're going in with this first. The bottom lashes or the bottom. Why can't I talk today? The bottom liner. I love it so much. Wow. Finish it off with some blue mascara. She's blue. I think I'm gonna go in with some black mascara on the bottom. So it's like black eyeliner, blue mascara, blue eyeliner, black mascara. I'm obsessed. And then I saw on TikTok, someone said to line your lips with the same color you do your eyebrows with. So that's what we're gonna do. All right, now for a little powder, a little blush, a little highlight and we'll be on our merry way. I've had this braid in my hair for like over a week now and I tied it into my little ponytails. Lana told me she was also doing pigtails so I was like, I guess we gotta do that too. I wanna show you guys my outfit, but I wanna show you London's at the same time. So I'm gonna hold off on that. I'm gonna get dressed, go pick up London, and then I'll show you both of our outfits. What's up, y'all? What is that? Uh, it's an eyelash. Get your little outfit on. What's up, Camille? I don't know where Cameron went. She said that she was gonna go film TikToks while she was waiting for me to get ready. So let's go find her. I need a hair tie. Good fella. <laughs> Rest you in peace. Have a little hair tie. Yeah, but we only have black ones. I don't do. You're so blue, Cam. I'm blue. Are you ready? Yep. Corbin's coming. <gasps> really? Yeah. Is he gonna meet us there? We're picking him up. We're picking him up. <sighs> circle mirror, circle mirror, circle Look at mirror. Look us, we're so cute. Like, start, start. Official fit check. Everything's thrifted. I got some cute rings on. This cute little necklace. We've seen the hair look and everything. Super cute. And then London is like the opposite of me. She's got like a white little knit sweater, black tennis skirt. Girl, shh. Okay, okay, do your fit check, do your fit check. I have this white sweater from Shein. I have this fishnet from Shein. I got a black little tennis skirt I got from Goodwill. You could get a little jellyfish. 
<laughs> <laughs> and then I just got some Air Force Ones. I was going to steal my sister's dogs, but they're mad uncomfortable. Aiden's? Yeah, she's like low-rise ones. She hasn't broken them in yet. Corbin better match. If Corbin isn't like as cute as us, I'm going to be mad. <laughs> okay, go change. I guess it was on the speaker. All right, are we ready? So I could step on a nail, or I could get a weight dropped on my foot. I wouldn't feel it. Steel boot. Nice. It's just some random brand. They're, these are really cheap. These are like $30 online. Or I found this at the thrift store. I like it though. It has like a wash, like a vintage wash on it, you know? Mm -hmm. This thing's all ripped up, like, it's crazy. <laughs> this is, yeah, my, everything's thrifted except for my shoes. Let's get it. Matching like my vibe, but white. Beach cover up. Gonna go to the beach camp. It would. It would be a beach cover up. We're all done. I'll show you guys later when I get home. But it was really cool like going through all the bins. I've never been to the bins before. And I'm someone who like, when I'm thrifting, I just look for things that really grab my attention. Like cool patterns. I love finding like statement pieces. And so at the bins, it's really easy to just like spot stuff from a mile away and be like, whoa, that's a cool color, that's a cool pattern. And then check it out. Half the time, it's like a really weird cut or it's just something weird. But the other half, it's really cool. I think my favorite thing I got was this like rainbow looking cardigan. You know me, my rainbows. Pride. Speaking of pride, me and Corbin, are you out? Can I say that we're going to pride? <laughs> like, yeah. really... Speaking of pride, me and Corbin were talking about going to a pride parade later this month. I think really, really important. Well, I don't think mom would let me take you to the I pride parade. I think mom would let me. Should I? Yeah. All right. It's worth asking. I'll ask mom. I want to go to Pride so bad, but there's one in Tampa later this month, and I really want to go. Do you think that she'll not let me go to Tampa to go to Pride, but I can go to Atlanta with you? 
what, what are you doing? You don't, you don't Car seat headrest. I have so much going on in the next like few months. Yeah, um, I don't know if I'm going to car seat headrest or not. Why? Because I like definitely want to go to Blade and it's at the same time. Oh, that's green. I'm going to a Mitski concert. Mitski, why can't I say her name? I'm going to Mit. I'm going to go see Mitski. Mitski. Where do we go? What's going on? Left. Right. <laughs> yeah, being an option. Left wasn't an option, so. But yeah, I'm going to a Mitski concert in Colorado this weekend. Ah! I was hoping today to find something cute enough to wear to the concert, but I don't know. Nothing's really matching the vibe, but I think I have something. It's gonna be cold though, it's gonna be so cold, so it's gonna be hard to dress for it. And then, later this month, when I get back from Colorado, Pride Parade, and then next month, a car seat headrest show, and that's in Atlanta. And then in May, I think Macy's coming to visit, and then in August, I think I'm going to Montana to visit her. So there's gonna be a lot of fun stuff going on soon, a lot of traveling, and I'm really excited. How was your thrift trip? Um, I got, like, just a lot of more graphic tees, and I already have so many graphic tees, so I just need to stop being graphic tees. <laughs> what about you? Um, every time I go thrifting, I get graphic tees, so I decided to stop buying graphic tees. I didn't get much. I got, well, I got some tank tops. I got a cool... I got some cool shoes. We'll show you guys in a bit. It is now time for a try and haul. I actually haven't tried any of it on yet because they don't have a dressing room. Not at the bins, at least. So let's have a little fashion show. This is the first thing I got. It's a little silk button-up shirt. I thought it'd be really cute with like a pair of just like flare jeans and just like a very simple look. It obviously speaks for itself, you know? But it's really comfortable. I feel really cute in this. This is one of them that I was like kind of second guessing, but I think it's adorable and I think there's a lot you could do with it. And then I got this little tank top. I love having tank tops to just like wear around the house. It's really comfy and simple and cute. And then I got this mustard yellow little cardigan. This is really cute. It's also really soft. However, there is two big holes in it that I just noticed, but you know, oh well. Here's the little rainbow cardigan that I was talking about. It's not really rainbow, but I just love all the colors. Yeah, I'm really happy about this one. And then I got this white sweater. I figured it'd be perfect for like going to the beach, but it's a little chilly out, but you want like a little cover up. I think this would be really cute for that. And I do that quite a lot. And then we got this little white sweater. This one's actually a lot softer than I thought it would be. It's gonna be perfect for Colorado. I really liked this one when I saw it, but seeing it on, I like love it. The sleeves just fit so like, you know? And just like the pleated, uh, wow, it's everything. And it's like my favorite color. But yeah, this is really cute. I probably wouldn't wear it with this, but imagine it with like some shorts, like tucked in. Now I feel like this might be one of my favorite finds. This pattern is just so cute. I love the colors. And it's like a mesh-ish, like see-through. Yeah, that's adorable. The sleeves. It's got like a little slit. This shirt just like took me back to like 2008. I have so many shirts just like this. And just brown and pink together. Always so cute. And then I got this one. It says... Dale Jr. It's also like a waffle material. I don't really know what that means. I don't know who Dale Jr. is. If anyone knows, let me know. This one's also just so cozy. And then I got this really sick, like tie-dyed purple Van Halen shirt. I would wear this with this outfit. I feel like this is really cute. And I love the lion on it. He's got little glasses. Wow. This was another one that I just wasn't really sure about, and I'm still not really sure about it, but I feel like styled in the right way, it would be really cute. And I just love this color yellow and like the little collar. I don't know. I think even just like with a different skirt, this would be like a look. This one's actually London's. It ended up in my bag though. There's a little hole. She told me she was gonna like distress it more though, so there's like holes everywhere and the other hole looks like it was supposed to be there. And then the back is really cool. This is really cute. I love this. I'm kind of sad that she found it and I didn't. And then I found this cute little pink jacket with like black seams on it, which actually looks really cute with this tank top. This isn't my typical style like at all, but I just felt like it was cute and I wanted it. I want to incorporate some more pink. And then I got this little black like halter towel dress. The material feels like a towel. 
I used to have little like cover up towel dresses like this all the time growing up and it really just brings me back. I didn't tie the whole through because I didn't feel like it, but you know. And then I got this cute little fuzzy pair of shorts. Really, really comfortable. And they're originally from Ari. You can't really tell, but they're like navy blue. And then I got this little duffel bag and it's like a grandma floral print, lots of space. I feel like it'd be a perfect bag for like going on a little sleepover. And then I got this little bag. It's kind of like different patches of different patterns. And then the back is all green. I don't know, it's like ugly cute, you know? Doesn't really match with anything I got today. Actually, it matches with that like mesh top. That'd be really cute together. And then I got a few things for the girls. I got Coco, this little dress. It's got like sheet of print on it. And then I got Dee Dee, this little dress. It's like a light purple with stripes. I love that. And then this, oh my gosh. It's like a little suspender skirt. And it's got little Aussies on it. Tell me that's not Aussie. Aussie oh, bud. Oh, just imagine. That's freaking adorable. And then I got some shoes. I got these black little like loafers. I've been wanting to do like ankle socks with loafers for a while. I just haven't found the right pair. I just want like a little berries and cream moment, you know? What y'all think? I could totally see it with like a little skirt. Imagine it with like the yellow button up one. Yeah. And then these boots reminded me so much of a pair that I had in eighth grade. And I just feel like I really need a pair of brown boots. I think it'd look really cute with like a little dress. Ugh, wow. And they fit so good. I'm so happy right now. Eighth grade Cameron is crying. And all of that was $30. That's insane. I definitely need to go through my closet and make room for all these clothes because when I was shopping, it didn't really seem like that much, but trying it all on, I'm like, I got a lot of stuff, but it was all really cute. Like not every time that I go to Goodwill is every single item I get like to die for, but I really, really love everything I got. And I'm really confident that I'm gonna wear it until I don't, and then I'll go back to Goodwill. Well, that wraps up today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Maybe got some inspiration, or maybe your style is completely different than mine and you were just like, girl, that it was not it. <laughs> Either way, I hope it was entertaining. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video, Kamalee. Okay,